Hello there, Madra here. Welcome back to E4 playing Byzantium. It's a wonderful time right here, and it's 1671. We're fighting a few different things right now. Encroachment of the nobility. Yeah, you can have it. I don't care. Genoa's declared war onto Venice. Very good for us. Very good for us. Hopefully, maybe. Uh, we're kind of just hoping to get enough war score right now. We're at minus six. It, it's tricky trying to get enough. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. You don't want to see that. Okay, actually, we won that. And that might... That's enough to give us the peace. Alrighty. So that's all I need. I literally just want this. You know, I don't care about anything else. Um, I really do just, just want that. So if I could... Can I just have some war reps or something? That's That's awesome. And just like a little bit of money... Perfect. That's all I want. That went way better than I expected. Fantastic. Oh, there we go. Okay, northern border. Reclaim the old northern border and reestablish a new frontier against the Germanic barbarians. Permanent claim for the Venetian area. And now I just have to own by Byzant own Byzantium, which is fantastic. Fantastic. Okay. Oh, that was exp that was that was very difficult. Lost the before that because there were zero cannons in the Merc stack. You're absolutely right, Combat Pillow. That is the reason I lost. Not having any boys, not having a sufficient number of boys in, of cannons in that Merc stack is a significant problem. Uh, the next fight. Oh, we have some Liberty Desire problems of Georgia. Dipper up in their large development. Uh, okay. No need for that. You're fine. Don't be like that. You're like no development. What are you talking about? Uh, I would really like to try and annex some of these guys soon, but I need to get enough points. God, why did I waste so many diplo power? So annoying when that happens. Okay, so let's um let's send these mercs to go take care of this. And then it's just gonna be getting our boys ready to attack Venice when the time comes. Perfect. Though, unfortunately, they are being attacked by Genoa. If I wanted to attack Genoa, could I do it? No. So I need to get some claims onto them immediately. Um, because if they take Venice, I'm not going to be able to do stuff to them, which is really unpleasant for me. Yeah. Uh, but even more frustrating is that when I attack Venice, I'm going to have to be attacking all of their allies. Although, to be fair, that is only Mecklenburg and Dortmund, but I also then need to be preparing to attack the Mamelukes, whom are quite strong. But I have six years to do that, so that's not too bad. The man on lawful territory. Yeah, that's a no, buddy. That's a no. Georgia wants to be a march. It's not happening. It's not happening. Sorry. I know why your trust is so low of me. Your trust is 100. What the Oh, they're a canid. They're actually a canid. Oh, okay. How do they become a canid? That is really weird. All right. Um. Sure, sure. Whatever. Okay. So, in terms of next up, it's obviously the Venetian War, and then cycling into the Memmans. Uh, of course, there's another one. Okay. E -e -e. Do you have any debts? We do not. We make a little bit of cash, which is good. Monarch in Venice. Oh, they died. Okay. Hey, that's all right. So I can still take everything. Oh, that's great. Okay, great. Um, That's in November. So this year. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Easy stuff. Easy, easy, easy. Uh, where's the fleet? Where's the fleet? There's the fleet. Hello, fleet. All right, let's get up here and get ready for the attack. The Admiral died. Okay. Ah, fine. I think we should also try and get some stuff into gear. And, I mean, we've already got a lot of claims in the Morocco, so trying to get more is not going to be easy. But that's fine. We can take up the entirety of the Andalusian area, which is good. 
These mercs can kill them, and then rotate back to the cap. Excellent. Silly is now being destroyed. Oh, it was just destroyed, but then the uh, war is over. Okay. Bohemia is massive and has just gobbled up everything. I almost really want to actually offer a vassalage to my own core provinces so they'll never accept me. I mean, vassalizing them would actually be pretty decent an idea because they have so much stuff. But if I do that, I'm going to be incurring a lot of wrath because I am going to have to take a lot of stuff in this war. Like, so much stuff, dude. Actually kind of crazy how much I'm going to have to take. It's okay. Ooh, look at that. Liberty Desire Reduction. Lovely. France is still nice and strong, which is good. How is their... Well, doing recent, decently well, I guess. They have a total manpower of only 33,000. With 1,000 development, though. They make a big pile of cash, which is nice. I could take 50% of their income as well. Oh my god. I could take 50% of their income. <sighs> that would leave them pretty much broke. So I'm not going to do that. That seems stupid. I'm not going to ruin them. But income from vassals, I can do. Oh yeah. Don't you want to force religion on them? Dude, if I force religion on them, I'm never going to be able to annex them. Well, actually, it does go down 1%. I'm not going to be doing that for about 30 years, so that's not too bad. Because my and relative power is only going to go up as well. Yeah, right. Let's enforce religion. Yeah, why not? And they'll convert stuff for us, right? No, I don't need them to do that. I'm the conversion. I'm just going to annex them and I'll convert it myself. You can't trick me, Odin. You're tricksy. That's you. You're tricksy. Merchant fractures. A dispute is broken out between several extremely wealthy and influential merchants over trade policy. Uh, support the mercantilist faction, prestige and legitimacy, or... Gain yeah, that's fine. Shut up. Okay. Doop doo doo. And now we attack Venice. Oh my god, these Georgian peasants, though, dude. Stop. Please. Begging you here. Now we kill Venice. Foreign court of Kilia. No, I don't care about you, Russia. And that's the truce with Russia. Turn dudes over. Oh, no, we have a trade power thing. God's sakes. Oh, God. Oh, God. Ah, there we go. They will no longer do it. Improvements in naval technology. Uh, my input, my, no. Right, there we go. Okay. Do a cleansing of heresy, because it's 100% cost and 75% E. We're not going to call in Sweden, there's no real point. Mecklenburg, Dormans, don't care about any of that, so let's go. Perfect. Nice, easy conflicts. They're basically dead already, so... And I think we're going to have to stay in this war for a very long time. Probably all the way up until 77 before we can um, attack the Mamluks. Oh, look, there's a 10k stack over there. And just and the French can just uh, kind of crush everybody else. Nice. We have a few Russian separatists, but that's okay. Looking good. Oh, Defender of the Orthodox Faith. That's kind of my job, buddy. I'm the Defender. Thank you very much. Everybody looks at me and they say, Wow, he's a Defender. Not you, buddy. Not you. Yeah, they have actually built up their army of a little bit. Oh, hello. Might I help you? Go, Joss. Oh, oh six, four. Bye-bye. <laughs> yeah, I'll take that. I'll take that. Thank you. Thank you very much. There's a military alliance with Kiwa, but that's fine. Kind of expected that. And uh, now... Go up here.
Let's go down there, and then we'll go up here. Gonna kill all your boys. Oh, that's the stuff. That's the so superiority you want. And now we're gonna head up there to their cap. Beautiful. Okay. We've got lads coming everywhere. Venice being destroyed once again. Our quartermaster died, unfortunately. My plus three of discipline. Oh, yes. Thank you very much. Oh, we can state Tunisia as well. We should definitely do that. That's a good state. Oh, yeah. Nice. And it can push towards Genoa, too. Yeah. Okay. This is great. We're doing really well here. Got some decent boys here. Which is over, but that's fine. Alright. Uh, we're good. We're in the clear. Pretty much here. I think uh, there's a lot of money that we could be getting elsewhere. Like, there's still quite a bit of cash that we're, like, missing out on here. Yeah, we need, like, an, a whole nother fleet of transport ships. Please. Here you go. Okay. And now we're just gonna hold on here. Oh, look at that. Siege of Venezia. Perfect. Uh, we're gonna go to Constantinople. Get ready the best place to stand if you have 50,000 boys. Sadly, pretty much nowhere. I got 52. That'll be fine. I got 33. You stay there. There we go. Perfect. So all we gotta do is just uh, basically take all of this. So how much is it gonna cost me? And I, yeah, I literally can't. I literally cannot do this. Okay. Um, unfortunate. I think I should take all of this. But I think maybe I should leave Venice because it's so good. And it's so big. Because look at that. That is so many people that will join the coalition against me. Uh, let's take that. Let's leave Treviso. A bit better. Yeah. Okay. We're going to have to do that. I really do want to take Treviso, but it's too bad. So we can take that, and then, like, in the next war, jump on them. Good. That should be fine. Why Verona? I want to take Verona because, Salt, you can't court right away. Well, the risk here is, is that Genoa or Trent will take it. Most likely, Genoa will take it. Uh, if I leave them, leave it there... Jenna will attack them for it and nick it. I can't. I know it means I can't core right away, but it, it's the only thing I can do to stop them taking too much stuff. I know it's really annoying. And the next is going to have to be Venice. It's going to death. This is going to slow me down, but it's the only thing I can really do that's going to encourage better path here. So now we can do this. Peace out really nicely. Core all that, and then just kind of head home really. You know, we can just chill. We can chill, guys. We got 14k. We've got kind of just sitting over here. But that's fine. I'd love to, like, vassalize Hungary or something, but too bad. Oh, Venice actually just went bankrupt. My goodness. Next up is going to be the Mamluks. This is giving us also a bit of time to, to get our boys ready. Which is great. We're so far ahead of stuff, which is awesome. So let's just speed through this right now. Let's get our lads this way. Oh, we can't, can't draw mercs. Master of Mint died. Ah, oh, come on. He was helping reduce my inflation problem, of which I had much. Get some tax modifiers over here. 
And I think whilst we have a couple years of peace and we know we don't need the money, we should definitely be looking at uh, investing some buildings. Uh, oh my god, yes. There we go. Perfect. Nice big pile of extra income there. Let's get drilling over here. Great. Okay. Can't drill in promise. Well, I'm trying, but you won't let me. And we've got a small army over here. We'll bring the ones over, and then we'll just kind of prepare to attack the Mamluks from two different areas at once. Although, actually, to be honest, it's actually a really stupid idea to attack from two at once, because they're just going to go to one and then kill it, right? They're just going to do that, and I don't... Oh, I clicked the wrong one there. So I'm actually just going to stay over here. There's not really any reason for me to be in this direction. Like, I don't really accomplish anything. So let's not do that. And we're now so strong that no one can really stop us. Although Russia, of course, does still have many more men than us. Uh, we can make and afford more. So I wouldn't be too nervous. Great expectations. You actually oh no, reinforcements. We're not making a pile of cash. Crown will pay off some of the Mistokian debt. Yeah, no special favors, bro. What are you doing? Go away. Okay, we're just going to start kind of pulling boys over. Nearest rebels are the city in Georgian. Which is fine. We'll take the mercenaries. Toledo defected to Spain. Wow. Cool. All right, where's the best place to be uh, drilling these chaps? Right here, of course. Great. Right. Good, so now we'll just go back this way. And just start drilling. You know, just start... Let's get them going. Good. Nice. A couple more ideas. The Liberty uh, Liberty and Subjects. Perfect. And soon, dip annexation cost. We'll get more relations. Which is always nice. Better reputation, which is even better. The vassal force them to contribution unjustified demands. Uh, in terms of policies, I do get income from vassals and institution spread, as well as a further dip annex cost reduction with administrative ideas. And I'm going to wait for that to be done. So I need to wait for the influence ideas to be completely done before I think about taking anybody. Which is a little annoying, but that's okay. I like how Spain is getting its country back slowly but surely. Yeah, very slowly, but it is happening, which is interesting. Like they're just like clawing it back bit by bit, which is really interesting like see happen we're gonna keep up the conversions of our new patriarchal authority bonus and how many troops to so the mamluks do have a hundred and ten thousand men remember so we gotta be ultra cautious of this like we really do need to be watching out for what we're doing and can't just die. Now these regions flipping to Spain instead of new nations. I know, isn't that hilarious? Like, it's just so odd to see. I find it very interesting to see. Watch happen. Just join. How long have you been streaming? Oh, I'm afraid, my friend. I'll be stopping in about a minute. I know. A little bit uh, ending a little bit early today. I'm just super beat today. Oh, we got more Georgian particularists, of course. Okay. So unspanish. Don't salt shakes. And how's it going, folks? So sorry you weren't able to join me for earlier, my friend. Oh, competitive advantage bonus. Um, but I'll be back again on Thursday for the next stream. And, and my, normally my streams are Wednesday, but this has been uh, moved because I have a beekeeping meeting on Wednesday that I wish to attend. Some of us have uni studies and a job. Hey, man, I totally get that. I, uh, yeah. I, I understand that feeling. I don't miss having to study uni. Oh, I hate this. It's just like none of these are any good. Once you get the administrative efficiency one, it kind of goes away. I suppose we could be... I just realized that I haven't been looking at my absolutism, have I? Christ. I could have been reducing my 
absolutism this entire time. You absolute dongle. That's me. Look at that. I, I just increased my absolutism my cr like a crazy amount. Son of a biscuit. Alright. That's it for the episode, guys. Make sure you leave, leave a like and a comment in the video. Let me take this series so far. In the next episode, as soon as we attack the Mamluks, we are going to immediately do the Recover Antioch mission to get the claims, beat them up, and then just before we peace out, we are going to change our icon from the Discipline one to the Aggressive Expansion Impact one, and then wait until we can attack Venice again for the rest of the claims, and then carry on from there. I was Algeron and THP. This has been you for. Bye-bye.